We had boxing gloves in, in, <laughs> in the locker room occasionally because that was like a sanctioned fight when it didn't just <laughs> boil over. You were like, yo. I did, I did get my <laughs> beat in one of, those, um, one of those locker room boxing matches <laughs> my uh, freshman year. I left uh, high school early and was up at Maryland uh, working out with the team, taking classes and doing uh, the spring ball stuff. And there was a corner that had been there for two years and I was just talking <laughs> It's like, we just finished lifting weights, and I was like, yeah, that's why I'm here. I'm taking his job. I'm going to be starting week one. And so we was, I was talking for a matter of weeks, and somebody was like, settle it with the gloves in the locker room. That's not how you need to settle it, because we could just set it on the field. But still, <laughs> I'm young. We went in there. I took – he's a nice guy. Him and I are still friends. And I, I know he's a nice guy because he hit me with one good one. I was dazed, <laughs> and it was over. And he did not follow up. <laughs> And we were friends from that point forward. And I was like, I'm going to go ahead and solve this football thing on the field. Yep. Any other issues, we can talk it out. Look, hierarchy was established, even if it wasn't on the depth chart. Dan, your turn. Uh, I, my fighting career ended with me getting my uh, shirt pulled over my head in a Coconut <laughs> Grove street. Uh, I, I've told Beaumont yes. this story before, <laughs> actually. Um, because I, I was not, weirdly, I was not afraid of fights. Um, but I guess at least in part because I, I didn't have that many of them, but I didn't lose them when I had them. And so, and I, and I don't say that like boastfully at all because I realized in the last fight that I had, which was over, uh, you know, an ex-girlfriend, I, I had to have been in my early twenties. I stood up against somebody and I looked at him and I'm like, Oh wait, he's not afraid either. And then, <laughs> as, and I'm like, Oh, wait a minute. If I'm thinking that I'm the one who's afraid. And then next thing you know, my shirt is pulled over my head and my ear is bleeding and I'm missing a shoe in the street. Uh, because, uh, I realized that when I had that thought, that was too much thinking. <laughs> yeah. Let, let me tell you why you ain't the dude to fight. Cause there's a distinct possibility that you the dude that start crying when you fight. And I don't mean that as an insult. I mean that you, everybody knows the guy I'm talking about, right? <laughs> like, it just gets to a point that there's nothing anybody can do, man. It is all in popping. <laughs> Yeah, them, them anger tears are terrifying. Yeah, <laughs> you know what? <laughs> uh, yeah. Like, it's all coming out right now. Oh, yeah. I've I been saw... nice to so many people. I have had enough.